Hey YouTube, John here. I'm going to be doing another little gameplay of Starbound. I did find a couple things that were very interesting and very useful. So for you guys with Starbound, you could actually go to these coordinates and get the items. One of them being a chest with diamonds in it, which was great, and a floor and village, which was really epic to check out. The other was an underground base with tech in it, which was actually double jump, as you can see here is very cool but anyway let's go ahead and get started here all right guys so I was searching for some gold I read that it's easier to mine in, on desert planets because the sand pretty much mines for you and I came across this pretty neat Florin village I'll show you guys the coordinates real quick here they are right here and it's this big ass desert planet it's actually the biggest planet I've been on so far it takes a really long time to go all the way around it. But anyway, here's the name here. And, of course, here's the solar system. But anyway, let's go ahead and go down to the planet. Now, I've actually went left and right. I'm not sure which way it's faster. I think this is actually completely on the other side of this planet, and it's a huge planet. By the way, guys, on the way to the, if you take the left way, there is this little underground passage here with the chest. Pretty neat little sewer system. But anyway, trucking on. All right, guys, so after about, I don't know, five to ten minutes of walking, like I said, this is probably on the exact opposite of the world, you come to this Florin village. I'm going to put away my weapon. This guy will attack you if you keep your weapon out too long. But if you put your weapon up, I think you're safe. Now, I've already looted some of these things because I did find five diamonds. Anyway, guys, the five diamonds were in this chest. Now, I'm not sure if they're actually going to be in there for anyone else that goes here. But it's probably worth checking out since diamonds are pretty rare. And also, there is a... As you can see, here's where I trapped the guy because I thought he was going to attack me. Now, I'm not going to risk it and, un and untrap him. I don't want him attacking me. Oh, shit. Let's not pull out my weapon. Anyway, this guy here is actually the vendor for food. And food is really cheap. Now, I'm not sure if there's any other good loot. I mean, finding five diamonds in that chest was pretty epic. I was not expecting it at all. house is actually pretty damn epic. enjoyed actually just exploring the tops of the planets not mining kind of sucks because gold is really rare or I've been having a lot of problems actually trying to find it but just exploring the tops of the planets and seeing the different things is really cool this village is actually the first time I've seen this but anyway guys this was the Florin village if you want a chance for diamonds like I said I'm not sure if it's always gonna be there but it is worth a look so go ahead and check it out alright guys after I got done exploring all of the floor and village and took everything that was useful to me I decided to go ahead and explore these other planets I did start with this one back here not this front one but this one back here and I actually came across a pretty badass underground base which I'm going to go explore now now like I said it is this back planet it's not this first one they're pretty much right on top of each other but anyway, it is in the same solar system, same coordinates, so you don't have to waste much fuel. But anyway, let's go ahead and check that out. Now 
I haven't went inside yet. Hopefully we find some goodies in here. here will look, looks extremely dangerous this is the first time I've seen this Quit using the blocks because it's not that hard to get past them. Once I realize you can't die in one hit, might as well actually try to try to get past them without cheating. Banana. I want you, banana. Oh, a chest. Very, very cool. Hopefully we get something badass. Pulse jump blueprint. Unlocks a pulse jump crafting schematic. Not entirely for sure what that is, but we will be checking that out. Let's go ahead and steal this chest as well. Very cool. I think the blue chest always spawn the same thing. I am not 100% sure on that, but I think it does. Alright, so I'm seeing to be high enough now that I can actually do this. For those of you that don't know, you can actually teleport underground as long as you're not too deep. All you have to do is break the back wall out using right click. As you can see, it pops up when I walk by here. All I did was break out that little bit of glass. Let's go ahead and teleport up to my ship. Alright, so I didn't know this. I had to go look it up. Tech is actually located in here. Well, I knew that was tech, but I didn't realize this. This is actually double jump, so you're definitely going to want to go pick this up, guys. All you do is click on it here and press lock in. And then you have double jump. I'm going to go back to the ground here and test it out. As you can see, I can actually jump twice, and I think it's useful. So when you fall off a cliff... You can actually jump before you hit the ground so you don't do as much damage when, once you hit the ground. Watch out, guy. So we're going to test that right now. Alright, so we're going to fall, jump. Very cool, no falling damage. Oh, that is so epic. Alright guys, well that was actually a very cool dungeon. Get the tech jump. Hopefully after they do this next update, this stuff stays in the same spot because I would really love to keep this. It would be extremely useful because I tend to die from falling damage quite a lot. And also being able to jump up and kill those damn annoying birds would be really great. Well alright guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm off to another planet here. If I find anything else really interesting, I will be showing you guys that as well. If you have any locations or coordinates for something really cool, I would really appreciate, appreciate a comment below for me to check it out. And like I said, the double jump is, is a really badass thing. It's, it's pretty much a must-have. I've seen some other tech which look pretty cool, but I haven't found it yet myself. But the jump, double jump becomes very, very useful. 
If you guys haven't seen this, this in the background, I'm actually traveling to another planet in the same solar system that I'm about to go explore, but it won't be in this video. See, here's the here's the two planets that I showed you in this video back here in the background here. But anyway, guys, if you have any comments, questions, or requests, please post them below. If you like this video and would like to see more videos, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching, guys. Thank you.